Okay, how are we doing out there? First things first, my name is Kenneth Bird. My company is Crystal Edge Technology Screens. Today we're doing some demonstrations inside and outside the home to show you exactly why our dark ambient light rejection or advanced ambient light rejection technology is the best. Now, as I said before, gray screen paints, gray projection screens, just can't cut it when it comes to uh, demonstration. When it comes to watching movies, sports, anything, anything that involves contrast or color, you're gonna have a problem. So let me show you how some of the amazing screens we have here in my home right now. I have my $60, yes, $60 ultra short though projector, no 4K, no uh, 1080p, none of that nonsense. Let's say it's not nonsense, but it's not something I have to spend the money for. Over here, we have my uh, 126 inch screen right here. And this is displaying my projector. I think this projector just came in 2014, yeah, 2014, 2012. This is my uh, 5,000 lumen uh, Christie projector that I only paid $500 for. So like I said, I didn't have to spend the money for uh, expensive 4K or expensive 1080p. You know, we don't have to use expensive projectors just to make our screens look amazing. And like I said, over here, again, we have to show this off really quick. Uh, this right here is our acoustic technology. Our acoustic technology comes in a 150 inches. So you got a choice of whether you want to break this down to a 50 inch screen, a 100 inch screen, a 120 inch screen, or you can come up with a 150 inch maximize the size of the screen. As I said before, look at it on the side. We have 190 view, degree viewing angle. And then over top, we have our ceiling coated and our technology, this is the Advanced Ambient Light Rejection Black Phoenix. Also on my $140 BenQ projector. Let's throw the lights on real quick to show you that the screen paint is Ambient Light Rejection technology. We can have our lights on. We can enjoy our massive screen over here. And keep in mind, my projector was only designed to do a screen size of a hundred, I think it's about 80 to 100 inches. And my screen size here is 148 inches. My screen size on the ceiling is 150 inches. And this is 126 right here. Let's go outside real quick because we got a screen going on out there right now. We're doing a demonstration. This came off of, uh, of uh, Facebook showing up a demonstration of the Elite. Sorry, the Elite uh, Yardmaster versus our technology. This is my 135 inch. And this right here is coated with our advanced ambient light rejection, Black Phoenix. Got over here a Christie 720p projector. I'm trying to see how far my stand's gonna go down. Okay, so I'm gonna show you at the end of the day, this is why you don't wanna go with a white screen or a gray screen paint mix. Right here, we have our Digital One Crystal screen paint. Over here, we have a screen paint by the fellow by the name of Crow 1176. This is the personal mix, light gray screen paint mix. Like I said, we made this about eight to nine years ago, but at the end of the day, as I said before, dark technology is more advanced. Red screen. Getting that from YouTube. One of the problems you're going to have when you're facing a gray screen paint mix or a white screen, as I said before, they don't have the ability to be able to see color. Blue screen. Getting that from YouTube. There you go. Even at 4,000 lumens. Let's do a color swap out real quick. Don't want to get eaten live by the bugs out here.
start a field screensaver? I found a few matches for that. Do you need... Cancel. All right. Start field screensaver? Getting that from YouTube. Okay, go through that every time. Sorry about that. Have you ever come up with a password so complicated, then bam, password rejected. Google's password manager yeah, creates, work. securely saves, and fills in passwords for all your online accounts. Not as serious as yours, Asher. Before. Can't pick up contrast, can't pick up color. Here. Mr. Wayne. Let's go fast forward to another scene. I am the League of Shadows. I am here to fulfill Raza Ghoul's destiny. Like I said, at the end of the day, that's something you don't want to go with. And as I said before, that if you're doing an outdoor setup or indoor setup, 
The best way to go is dark technology, our technology. That's why our technology is the best. We don't have to use expensive projectors. We don't have to calibrate. We don't have to be stuck in ambient light controlled environments. This is why our product is the best choice. So I love walking around showing off this black technology. Look how gorgeous that looks. And that's my projector sitting back 18 feet. I'll display the screen we have here on the ceiling too. This looks absolutely incredible. This shows how powerful our ambient light projection technology is. Four K demonstrations. Let's go play something nice. Why did we stuff Reese's Take Five with five flavors? Because you can't put these back in the sense. kitchen drawer where they belong. Them a couple more demonstrations before we turn the lights out. There's one sitting in the light. Mine is on a 720p projector.
like I said, no 4K, outdated projector, my Chrissy. Did not spend money for 4K, didn't spend the money for 1080p, just a basic 720p. And this is the kind of colors these screens are picking up. Where your gray screen paint mixes, gray screens and white screens, can't even see it. I don't know what's going on with the sound. The sound was playing for a few minutes ago, but it cut off. But I figured the video probably can't pick up the sound. Let's see this for a minute. Show you the model number. My projector right there. Let's just see if we can get some sound in here real quick. Getting that from YouTube. to the 40. Stiffen up against the Panthers. And got that win. Here's Fournette. Regular season length. On first <laughs> down. Picks up seven. Brady. Pass complete. Godwin. Brady. Godwin makes the catch. First down. First and goal at the six. And the Eskin family. Second and goal. Brady keeps. Throws and caught. OJ Howard for the touchdown. Ooh, that's nice. I gotta get a chance to watch some football out here, man. I got all these screens in my house, so I didn't get a chance to watch football. Too busy working.
Getting that from YouTube. Tropical fish, relaxing. Getting that from YouTube. Just about done. 4K fireworks display. Getting that from YouTube.
internet issue out right here. Wait for a minute. Let me adjust my bunch of my real quick. Thank you. 
do because I got to get in the house. Mosquitoes are getting happy out here. Got to be invested in a bug zapper sooner or later. Really quick so we're doing a live demonstration on Facebook uh, problem with that is the fact that I couldn't get a um, signal to pick up outside so we had to do the recording all over again which I'm doing right now but just to show you at the end of the day how amazing our technology is we can use the lights on lights off looks amazing outside and as I said before gray screen paints and white screens just cannot pick up those contrasts cannot pick up color they can pick up white levels but that's as far as it goes Let's see what else we're playing out here real quick. Just got to pop my head out here a little bit. You can't come back in. I like coming back there. Look at this screen real quick. And it shows you how amazing our ambient light projection technology is. Paint it directly to the ceiling. This is Taco Land right here. If you want to know what this is, I have a cat. This is his area right here. There's a screen at 126 inches that sits in the bay of windows. Looks absolutely incredible. Oh, why have I got an air conditioner on? All right, so I hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. I'd like to thank you all for your time. Our screen paints are available on our website with free worldwide shipping. Like I said, one thing you don't want to go with, like I said, we used to make gray screen paints back in the day under my old company, under Digital One Crystal Screen Paint. That's what that is. There's the Elite White Screen. And there is a gray screen paint mix made by a fellow by the name of Crow 1176. Like I said, it does have a slight better improvement than a white screen, but at the end of the day, a white screen can't pick up color or contrast, and neither can this. Just a simple, basic red. Red screen. This is why you don't want to go with gray screen paint. There you go. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video demonstration. I'd like to thank you all for your time. Oh, let me get that off of there real quick. Right 
mind, there's my 720p Chrissy projector. anywhere in the house. I'm gonna have to get some fresh tape for that one. Put you guys right here for just for a minute. And as you can see right there, washed out. On the acoustic screen, it's supposed to be deep blues coming up. As you see again on the chocolate cake, washed out again. That's what I said before, if they can pick up white levels, the only problem is you can't see contrast and can't see color. Don't do well in ambient light um, environments. I was gonna say controlled environments, this is far from a controlled environment. All right, gotta go, thank you for your time, and God bless.